Team coverage of this major holiday travel day continues now straight from Norfolk International Airport. We've been watching the flight tracker all day. Things seem to be moving slowly despite the massive crowds. Tending your size, Gina Arevalo has seen it firsthand today. She joins us live from the airport tonight. Gina. Hey guys, yes, we've got some flights that are just now coming in. They have been coming in all day and all night. Now, one thing we're hearing from passengers, they are surprised at how easy it was to make their flights. There's nothing like being home for the holidays. I'm heading to Cincinnati. And who are you visiting? Uh, my family, my mom, dad, and brother. Just going to New York, seeing all the people there and everything else, Rockefeller, you know, ice skating. An estimated 10,000 people are flying out of Norfolk International Airport today and tomorrow, and thousands more are flying in. AAA says it's the busiest Thanksgiving travel season in 12 years. I enjoyed the ride. This is my first flight. But people say, surprisingly, the crowds weren't what they anticipated. It wasn't bad. You know, it was, you know, not, not nearly as bad as the train station last night when I went to pick her up. That was packed. For many people, check-in lines were short and getting through security was a breeze. This was much easier and we have traveled at Thanksgiving before and it was a nightmare. But others had some hiccups along the way. It was congested with a lot of people. And so, you know, it took, it took a more time. It took us 12 hours to get here. Well, we had layovers and the plane had malfunction. There were also lots of hugs and reunions. I'm freaking out. I'm so <laughs> happy and excited and just, just overwhelmed. You know, I'm so glad he actually gets to be here for the holidays. These families have been waiting six months for their service members to come home from the Middle East. I can't believe it's real. I'm just happy to be home with my family. I know they miss me. Yes. I'm just happy to be home. A long time, but definitely worth the wait. It feels amazing. It's, um, <laughs> I'm very thankful, extra thankful this Thanksgiving and blessed. Now, flights are still coming in tonight. I just checked the flight information board, and we've got some arrivals that were actually scheduled to get here around 1130, 1145. They've been delayed, so the airport officials are advising if you have a flight tomorrow or any time over the next few days, check the flight status before you come to the airport. And for traveling out of the country, get here two hours before. If you're traveling domestically, get here 90 minutes before. Reporting live in Norfolk, Gina Arevalo, 10 on your side.